there is big news about the latest Chinese stealth fighter, the J-35. Two photos surfaced online, and one of them shows the J-35's details never seen before. It is the best quality photo of the J-35 so far. The fighter is marked with 35003, indicating this is the third aircraft of this particular batch of J-35 prototypes. The J-35 is the first medium-sized stealth fighter from China. In many ways, it is similar to the American F-35, but since it is a two-engine design, there is a fundamental difference between the two. It also confirms the aircraft is indeed called J-35, not J-31. The number 3, 5, 000, 3, proves that the latest J-35 design already produces at least three aircraft. Also, this is the first photo of the J-35 in the Chinese Navy stealth scheme, similar to the J-20 stealth fighter scheme. A subdued Chinese military insignia is painted next to the cockpit. However, I would need to highlight that, in the other photo, there is no such insignia. I am doubtful if the insignia is actually doctored in the first photo. If it does have the military insignia, based on experience, this proves the J-35 has been officially adopted by the Chinese military, like the Navy. If this is true, then it is a major breakthrough in the long J-35 project. The project has gone through three stages already, the FC-31 demonstrator, the first J-35 prototype, also called J-35 1.0, and then the latest so-called J-35 2.0 design displayed in this photo. The vertical tail also has a logo that could be a shark or an eagle. The J-35 is believed to have the nickname Jerfalcon. This aircraft could be the second flying prototype. At the front of the J-35, there is a data sensor tube for testing data collection purposes, which will be removed in mass-produced aircraft. A radar dome with lighter colored paint houses a Chinese active electronic scan array radar. Then a huge canopy similar to the F-35 design opens forward, which is different from the J-35 1.0 prototype. The canopy joins a large integral bulkhead at the rear, a common design in the latest stealth fighters to free up space for an internal weapon bay. The pilot's direct rearward visibility is limited. This shows the Chinese might have trouble designing a rear-hinged canopy and decide to go with the same idea as the F-35. The J-35 has two diverterless supersonic inlets. For the first time, we can see there is an opening cover after the inlet, again similar to the F-35, likely hosting a fueling port and some equipment connections. There is no side weapon bay like the J-20 or F-22. The photo does not offer a view of the internal weapon bay. The J-35 is the first dedicated catapult-launched fighter in China. In the new photo, we can see the front landing gear resembles the triangle layout design of the F-18 and F-35. We can barely see the folding wings openings in this photo. It is believed that the J-35 can fold its main wings. In the other new photo, we can see the main wings are enormous, giving an impression of the US F-35C naval variant. Because of the relatively wide body to allocate internal weapon bay, the J-35, like the F-35, must have large tails both vertically and horizontally. This is bad for stealth and weight, but a bulkier body will require much better stability control surfaces. The other particularly noticeable details are its engines, which have pronounced serrated exhaust nozzles and rear fuselage cowlings. This may be the first time we have a clear view of the new WS-21 turbofan engines, with thrusts similar to the RD-93 from the latest MiG-29 variants. Some sources also claim that the WS-13E turbofan is the engine of choice. Many of the low observable design features can be spotted in this photo. It would not be a surprise if this is indeed a true stealthy aircraft, unlike the Korean KF-21 prototype that took first flight around the same time. It is worth mentioning that the Russian, Turkish, and Indian medium-sized stealth fighters are still on paper. China is clearly ahead of everyone except the United States. Overall, the J-35 appears to have a seamless surface, with minimally exposed panels, large fasteners, gaps, creases, and antennas that could be detrimental to stealth performance. We can also observe some Chinese ground crews taking a break under the aircraft. Analysts widely believe the J-35 fighter will need a few years to reach mature status. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please subscribe, share and comment. It will really help us developing this channel and bring you more videos about Chinese military news. Thank you.